Get you back on our video. Here is my whole the beauty haul the duty figures for Easter. I already took the rock for the man and then being out because that's just a basic. And I do have the battle packs, but those ones I do keep because they're from 1986. So starting off with the first figure I really like. It's Elite Series 56 Luke Gallows. And I really like this figure because I like the articulation. I don't have this figure. I recommend highly to get it. Because it says G Brothers for Life. I really like that. So, yep. Cool Luke Gallows one. And you should pick up the W Elite Series 9 Luke Gallows too. That would be a good one for a head swap. And, that, and the other one without his beard, you should add on this one so it could be a custom. So, yeah, that's my advice to you about this Luke Gallows I got from... Um, Easter, so yeah, and it's the let me see. Um, diorama, dioramas or dioramas drawn by Rob Schamberger, and it says all of this stuff. You should pick this up and read what it says, or I could just read it right now. It says that the good brothers are all about being mean and making green, dominating in every country around the globe. Career highlights he was a rock tag team champion. From by way of Tokyo, Japan, 290 pounds, 6 foot 8, and his finisher is Magic Killer. And here are the, all the other figures in the line. They have Roman Rings, Gentleman Jack Gallagher, AJ Styles, Samoa Joe, and I picked up the Luke Gallows. And here's the Carl Anderson that I still need to finish the Good Brothers. And the second toy I picked up that I went to my dad's house was kind of, I looked at this one first, because I love this battle pack of Bret Hart and Jim Neidhart. And this one you sh I should recommend you pick up, because this one's an old one, and they only see, this one was on 1986, so you should pick this up before this is out on stores. You just picked it up. So yeah, you can run online for eBay about maybe 15 or something. 15 to 22 dollars. So maybe pick that up in stores. Well, I still have it in stores, maybe. So, yeah, and on the and it's the Heart Foundation. This one's in really old battle pack. And the one that I also highly recommend is the Rusev and Roman Rings from the Raw as seen on TV in 2016. And Bray Wyatt and Luke Carper as seen in 2016. If you're a girl, if you're a girl, you should highly recommend pick up Sasha Banks and the Charlotte for your collection that you're collecting. So yeah, that was the Hard Foundation. So the one that I really hit me up was the Apollo Crews from NXT. I mean, this comes with the NXT jacket and his jacket. This attire is really sick. I'm keeping this. In the box, so I might sell it to you in the late future. So tell me in the comment section below in about three years or so, or like about in this video after you watch it, you should comment if you want this. I might sell it to you in about a couple of years, you know, ship it out in a couple of years because I want to see how much value it is on eBay. So you could sell it to someone else that will sell it on and sell it on. So yeah, and it says he ha he is. Six foot one inches for his height, and he his weight is two hundred forty pounds. He's from Stone Mountain, Gangsville, and ring attire was April twenty sixteen. Signature move was standing moonsault, and he has not been any champion yet. And it says collect them all to create an exclusive diorama. The other people are in the set. Are Becky Lynch, Enzo Amore, Big Chas, Brutus the Barber, Beef Cape, Beef Cake, not Beef Cape, and Randy Orton. And it says on the back, and it shows you a full exclusive diorama or diorama in the set. And the other figure that I was actually psyched about was the Sami Zayn. From 2017, I'm pretty sure, 
We're 2016. This is series 51 with the Luke Gall with the um Apollo Crews, and I really highly recommend to pick this. Seems easy enough if you want to do swap or custom on it. Yeah, and you should like put a different head skin, and, like sculpt more hair. Or, like, actually cut the hair down more. But this Simi Zayn, now I've feud in SmackDown, is with Daniel Bryan and Shane McMahon. Because Daniel Bryan just got magically cleared. Really cool, Daniel Bryan. You're the best wrestler, in my opinion. Top three wrestlers are, like, or Daniel Bryan, Roman Reigns, Seth Rollins, Finn Balor, and mostly Shane McMahon. In Triple H. And Mr. McMahon when he got scared of stuff. Like, he was, like, really shocked that that person returned. And it says that he is six foot one, 212 pounds, from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Ring of Terror is from July 14, 2016. Sarah and she move is the hula the kick. It should be the finisher. But his career highlights were the NXT champion... Um, probably Intercontinental Champion, and that's it, I'm pretty sure. There are figures in the set you can get. Worm Rings from the Raw. AJ Styles from SmackDown. Mankind from the old set, but it still shows the WWE logo. Scott Hall from NWO, and he's in the WCW line. And... Um, Berserker, I, you should pick up the whole set so you can have the whole collection, and I actually have a, a wall of actually all my figures, and I'll show you that right now, and it's still to set up two figures, but I'm really sure that I can get these back to you, here is mine. Elites and my best favorite figures on this wall. So it starts off with the defining moments, Chris Jericho. You should pick that up. That one's the best figure that I love. Entrance Gates, Kurt Angle that plays his music. That one's a good one too to pick up. And Bruce's aggression to Tisa. I don't think any of you are going to see anymore. Elite Series 56 Luke Gallows. You should pick that up before it gets out of stock. And Elite Series 12 Kane with the sign. You can see inside that sign. There are real signs because my mom was married to Kane a couple a couple years back in like 2010 or 2011 and 2012. Then 2013, she couldn't stop with him. So here's the WrestleMania Heritage Series. Um, Kane signed actually. Um, and Apollo Cruise that I highly re recommend picking up. So that was everything, guys. Love all of you, and see you later in my next videos. Bye, guys.